on-the-scene video coverage of ESC 2012 is supported by Prodexa. Previous disasters have been met with an increase in various health problems, including acute coronary syndromes, stroke, and pulmonary embolism. A study presented here showed that a similar phenomenon was seen following the earthquake and resulting tsunami in Japan last year, which killed nearly 16,000 people. Richard Conti, a former president of the American College of Cardiology, talked about the lessons that can be learned. What does a disaster do? The disaster probably raises the body's adrenaline levels, which raise the blood pressure and get all, raise the heart rate and do all the things that are not terribly good for you from the standpoint of heart. Um, this has been reported before in earthquakes, and I believe also after 9-11 there was an increase in admission to coronary care units because of people who had bad heart conditions or people who didn't have heart conditions and they developed them. So it's, unreal, it's really unknown, but there is a condition called takosubu, which the Japanese invented, called, uh, uh, and this, is, this occurs after, uh, for example, if your child was run over by a car right in front of you. That's what raises your adrenaline levels and things of that nature. I think that's the same thing that happened in this tsunami. For On the Scene Video at the ESC Congress, I'm Todd Neal, MedPitch Today. Today.